Hey, it's Jesse Born in the workshop, and today I'm just going to show you guys what I'm doing tonight. It's uh, 6.30, and I've already eaten dinner. I came out here at 8 o'clock this morning, so it's been a pretty long day in the workshop, but I'm getting lost down on the puzzle chest, and it's going fantastic. This morning I got these parts done. I made these totally from uh, start to finish today, with the exception I just played in the wood yesterday or the day before, but uh, it went really nice and I inlaid these catalogs pieces here so that makes a really nice effect and as you see on the corners here I just put a nice radius on there and the way that I do that is I just take this kind of plane this Japanese pull plane and I just went right down the edges right here just like that and that gives that nice bevel that you get on here and of course this is the end grain facing you so um, I'm a big fan of the end grain, it looks really good. So I'm gonna do the same thing on these parts that I just machined today. So um, you would have seen in the footage, these chucked up in the mill and then I just took the end mill bit right into there and I made that little groove in there which is part of the mechanism. And now that that's done, I'll just, I'll finish these for you guys and show you exactly what goes on. So I just take this plane. Now the way you set this thing is you just take the hammer and you just tap it until the blade is protruding at about the approximate distance that you are looking for to give you a nice cut. Now, the thinner shaving you'll do, the better the, uh, the finish will be on the wood. You know, if you're taking a deep cut, you might uh, be ripping out the fibers more easily. So I just do it pretty light, and then I'll just take two shavings. And that gives me that effect which uh, works really well. Okay, so that's it. Thanks for watching the video and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye.